Hey guys, it's Miss K Chris, and welcome back to my advice channel wherein I give a lot of advice to people who want to be a flight attendant. So today's video is going to be answering the question why do you want to be a flight attendant or a cabin crew? Pretty easy question, right? <laughs> but why is it that a lot of you guys are requesting it from me? <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, so the proper way to answer this question, uh, honestly, is to be professional about it. We all have our own reasons why we do things, why we, why we aspire for things, and why we want things, okay? So in a job interview, this is not the place where you will tell your most deepest secret and deepest desires and um, hopes of your heart <laughs> to the recruiter, okay? So this is a place of business, and this is where they need to know your motivations, why you are applying to them, why what is your motivation? What will motivate you to do the job? And why 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 is it why? They just want to know why you're there. Okay? Pretty nosy, but yeah, it is one of those things that they frequently ask. And it is one of the things that most of you are discombobulated or confused on how to answer it. Okay. So the classic I want to be a flight attendant because I want to travel the world and um, you know go on tours for free is totally out of the window forget about that a lot of people already answered that way so don't answer that way okay please please lungs don't answer that um that gas gas <laughs> the overused line that you want to travel the world and see the world for yourself while you are doing it for free okay so that's not gonna work What you need to do though is you need to look at this as a transaction. It's a business transaction. You are there offering your service, okay? And they are there trying to see if you're a good fit for you. So that is how you should look at it. And how you should answer it, you should think in your mind um, why they are, they are asking me this question. So the reason that they're asking you this question is they want to know if you have any idea what the flight attendant is so make sure that on your answer you incorporate that that you know what flight attendant does they don't just travel the world they don't just take selfies on the Eiffel Tower and things like that so make sure that you do more research on what a flight attendant does and number two you focus on what you can bring to the table what can you give them what can you offer them not what you can take from them okay so now let's answer this question so this is what you guys have been waiting for let's forward it to that okay I always wanted to become a flight attendant ever since my first experience of flight as a kid I remember my first um, flight and it has made such an impression for me that I have always aspired to become part of the flight attendant team. Even though I very much enjoy my current job, I am now looking for a job that is hands-on, challenging, spontaneous, and something that will help me grow as an individual. And I really think that I have the qualities that is needed in the role of a flight attendant. I really love working with people. Um, if you will let me choose with working in front of a computer or working with people, I will definitely work with people. I love it when everyone is working towards the same goal and achieving the same thing and afterwards celebrating together as well. So <laughs> aside from that, I really love the, I understand and I know that the excellent service is the bread and butter of the airline industry because every airline out there can offer the same thing maybe at a lower price but if you offer them the best service that is that would make an impression with them just like it did when i was a child they will always come back and be loyal to your airline and i am very much ready to become a part of that team that would make that happen to make that excellent service happen for your company. Given the chance, 
I'm here and I'm ready and I'm ready to take on the challenge of being a flight attendant for you. Thank you. Okay, so guys, that is how you answer the question. You don't know how many takes I took to get that question, <laughs> to take that answer, right? So anyways, that is it, guys. If you want to know more, um, you would also notice that the answer that I, I use on this video is very much like the same answer I have here on the, on the book that I have written. On this book, I have written different types of questions and how to answer them. Um, basic questions as well as airline specific questions that they will definitely ask you during your flight attendant interview so this book is now available on amazon make sure that you check it out it's called ready for takeoff eight steps eight proven steps to get your dream job as a flight attendant and if you are in the philippines you can get a copy on this through my website if you have a credit card and if you don't you can get it through shopee.ph it's an app based um, shopping app where you could order this there and yeah we will ship it to you every Sunday and this is for $5.49 and this comes with free shipping nationwide so make sure you check that out and if you like this video make sure that you give it a thumbs up or like if you are watching it in Facebook and share it to your friends who you think would benefit from this kind of video as well as subscribe to this channel please <laughs> and click on that notification bell beside the subscribe button so you would be informed if I have new videos that are coming up and yeah that's it and that's all for today thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys on the next video fly with you soon bye subscribe with me soon <laughs> May ano na na-off yung laptop ko na na-record kaya yun. To interact and talk and uh, interact and uh, oh god, it's so 